Hey everybody, it's Jonathan. Today I'm reviewing an app called Google Chrome. Google just released Chrome last week for iOS devices and of course it's been available for download on computer for a while now and a lot of people have been very impressed with it. So I went ahead and tried it out on my phone and noticed that it's much faster than Safari. If you notice the videos here, you notice how much faster it is when I load YouTube.com. But uh, let's get right into this review, everybody, and I'll show you how awesome this app is and how useful it can be. Okay, so when you open Chrome, the first thing you notice is the URL bar where you can type your website address in. You can either type this in or you can press this button here and speak the website you want to uh, visit. So let's go ahead and do it now. YouTube.com. You can see here it pulled up YouTube.com. So Google has added voice recognition to this app, which is extremely nice. Also, while you're on a web page, you can press this icon here and it brings up this little menu. You can click the star to add a bookmark. So let's do that now. And you can see here it said add bookmark and I can put it in the, yes, mobile bookmarks is the only one I have available now, but I can choose a new folder and rename it. So let's just go back to cancel that and let's just put in mobile bookmarks. Okay, so let's save it and we're done. We have that in the bookmark. Okay, also in this menu you can choose new tab and this is really neat. You can choose up to a limited number of tabs which in Safari I can't remember. There's just several you can do but um, in Chrome you can do unlimited tabs so you can open all these web pages up Facebook, Google Plus, all these things you can add while you're browsing YouTube and you can just swap back and forth. So that, that's a really neat feature that Chrome has added. Okay, so let's go back to the URL search bar and let me show you something really neat that I like. Say that I wanted to search for Facebook.com, I will type in FA and it automatically pulls up Facebook here. So Google has implemented this to kind of speed up the process if you type so you've got to type it all in it knows what you're trying to search for so I thought that was really neat okay so let's go back to this icon here and we went, already went over bookmarks so let's just go over the settings real fast and here you can do you can sign into Chrome you can save password voice search you can clear your browsing data report an issue privacy context settings and about Google Chrome so that is settings. So I'm going to wrap this review up now, guys. The number one thing that I'm impressed with, really, with this application is the uh, browsing speed compared to Safari. It's not extremely much faster than Safari, but it's fast enough that I'm going to be using this from now on instead of Safari. So thanks for watching my video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that subscribe button right here. Like this video, guys, and comment down below. I really appreciate that. And like my Facebook page, follow me on Twitter, add me on Google Plus, search for me on Instagram. All these links will be in the description below. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.